Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another edition. It's actually my first of the year and it's already March of copying Pinterest outfits. This is one of my favorite videos to do. I say it in every copying Pinterest outfit video, but I just love doing these videos. They're so fun. And I love Pinterest. If you are a Pinterest lover like me, that's where I get a lot of inspiration for my home, for my wardrobe, mostly my home and my wardrobe, and sometimes some recipes. There's some good recipes on there. Today I thought I would take five of my pinned outfits that I pinned on my boards and recreate them from my closet. This is what I love to do. I highly suggest doing this if you don't do it already. Go on Pinterest, pin a bunch mindlessly, then go in your closet and recreate these outfits. It is so fun to do. And also it just makes you think of some of the pieces in your closet in a different way. I have recreated so many different outfits and it's been so fun to kind of change things up, especially when you get in a row with your closet where you're like, I don't know what to wear. Go to your Pinterest board. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so outfit number one is going to be, actually she is a YouTuber. I think she's from the UK. She's a little bit younger than me. She's super trendy and has the cutest clothes. And I have been pinning, I actually have two outfits from her. I'm gonna link her channel down below. Um, I think her name is Ruby Holly, um, but her outfits are so cute. They're really neutral. They're very just wearable as well. But outfit number one is probably one of my favorites and I'm probably Probably gonna be wearing this outfit all spring long and I love how she did it so it's actually a matching loungewear set and she threw a trench over it which I think is such a great it just dresses up your loungewear a little bit because we're all still wearing our loungewear um, and then a great pair of sneakers a black bag and a hat so I thought this would be super fun to recreate so this is outfit number one. All right, so here is outfit number one. <laughs> I tried to recreate it. I think I did it pretty good. Um, I love the matching loungewear set with the trench. Totally going to rock this this spring. Some white tunnies. I didn't have a light color hat. Um, I just have like a darker gray one. So I think it works. Then her little circle, kind of, I have these from Amazon. I'll link them down below. They're like these little Ray-Ban dupes. They were like $12, they're so good. And then a black bag. I love this outfit. I seriously love it so, so much. Definitely going to wear this in real life. I love how it's put together. All right, outfit number two is definitely a classic outfit. It is something that I feel like is so great for every day, but also for a really dressed up look. It's very simple, it's very minimalistic, and I love it. <laughs> so it is a pair of white denim, a black blazer, which is a total closet staple, and I finally found a really good one, um, and a black cami, some little sandals, a straw bag, and you can easily take this look and recreate it into a more cold weather, like fall, even winter style outfit, which is what I love about this look. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to recreate it. The outfit number two, I got my white skinny jeans, a black little cami top, a oversized kind of black blazer, which I feel like all of these things are like staples that maybe we already have in our closet. Maybe we already wear these together, but I love how she kind of paired some really summery, springy items by adding the sandals and the straw bag. I think it's so cute together. Um, so this is look number two. All right, outfit number three is going to be a really comfy out outfit again. Apparently, I'm really into like l dressing up your loungewear. <laughs> That's what I'm really into right now because I just wanna be comfortable, but I also wanna feel like I'm put together so I am productive. That is, that is the key there. So this outfit is so cute. The shacket is totally in right now, a plaid shacket. I love her really long one. I have one that's a little bit long, but not as long as hers. Um, this isn't actually a matching set if you look really closely um, when I do the outfit. She actually has a pair of joggers on and then kind of a similar toned sweatshirt. So I'm gonna kind of recreate this a little bit 
bit and try to find something in my closet that goes probably not exact to what she's wearing, um, but a little bit close and then some white sneakers. So let's try to re recreate it. All right, here is outfit number three. The funny thing is, Every single thing that I'm wearing right now is from Amazon, or I got it off Amazon. Um, this is an Amazon little shacket that I recently found. So cute, I love the colors of it. Really cute for spring. It's definitely a lightweight option. Um, a sweater that I've had forever <laughs> from Amazon that I love. I actually have it in white as well. And then a pair of joggers that I recently shared from Amazon that I'm also obsessed with. And my sneakers also from Amazon, but you can get these other places. These are just some white classic Reeboks, some white shoes. These are my favorite white leather tennies. Love this outfit, super cute, super comfy, and it's all from Amazon. So you can recreate Pinterest outfits from Amazon. Okay, outfit number four. Alana Davison. I love I love watching her videos. She is like the beauty queen and she is like so good at neutrals. I saw this outfit. <laughs> I pinned it like a million times actually because I love it. It is just so fresh for spring but also really cozy and comfy. So she did a pair of white joggers. I think I'm gonna do a pair of like creamish joggers that I have. Um, she did a chunky turtleneck sweater, threw her denim jacket on, some white sneakers. I love this look. So fresh, so comfortable for spring. Definitely an outfit I am going to be wearing. So here is outfit number four, Alana's outfit. I love it. Um, I think it's so cute. She has more of like a white or like an off-white jogger. I have these cream ones, but I feel like you still get the neutral vibe from this outfit. I have an oversized kind of tunic length, turtleneck sweater, creamish color, and then the denim jacket. I who love this outfit. I absolutely love it for the spring. It's just so fresh and comfortable and it's something that you can definitely be comfortable in all day long. So I love this look, so good. Thank you for inspiring me, Alana. All right, and then outfit number five is another Ruby Holly outfit. I told you I've been pinning a ton of her outfits. They're just so cute and just classic I feel like so this one is definitely a classic look it is a black blazer a white t-shirt a pair of light wash denim some mules a black bag so classic so easy so chic so simple great for every day but you look really dressed up so I'm gonna recreate it All right, and then outfit number five so chic I'm obsessed with this outfit it is so classic it will like never go out of style. And these are all things we probably already own in our closet. A white t-shirt, a pair of really good denim, a black blazer, some black shoes, a black bag, some cute sunnies, and you're off to go. I love it. It is so chic. It's very like minimal, but it looks so good on just about anybody. So I love it. Um, this blazer I shared in the previous outfit is also from H&M. These are my favorite Levi's and I think I saw them back in stock. Um, and I actually chopped them a little bit more because <laughs> they were like a little bit too long on me, a little awkward length. So I cut them and now they're like my favorite denim ever. So if you have short people problems like me, <laughs> just cut your denim. Um, and then some black shoes, staples. Everybody has this in their closet. So it's just a really great go-to, especially for the spring. All right guys, so that is my spring edition of copying Pinterest outfits. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely give it a thumbs up if you did like it. And let me know in the comments if you wanna see more of these because I haven't done them in a while and I really miss doing them. So if you like this video, definitely let me know. Stay and subscribe if you're not subscribed to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.